Good morning, YouTube family. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Danielle. And if you're not new here, welcome the heck back. 7.21 in the morning. I'm gonna do a little weekend vlog, a few days in my life. You might feel like you're swinging back and forth. That's because you're on my plant shelf. So. <sighs> I've been wanting to do this for a long time now. Start my vlog back up. I just got the urge to finally pick it up back today. I have had a rough week with my mental health and just focusing on productivity and that usually really puts a damper on my mood and just how I feel and um, my relationship with food and my body and movement kind of trickles all into one. It's lovely. I had a good cry session last night. Sometimes crying is freaking great. Sometimes I need a good cry sesh because I bottle things up and I need to just release it. Clay's not here this weekend, so it's just a weekend with me. And trying to navigate being alone is kind of hard. I thought I loved alone time. Mm. Mm. I don't know about that now. I've missed creating this type of content. I feel like talking like this and honestly just going through my day to day with you guys is gonna help me as well. I am really excited to get back into this and hopefully I can just stay consistent with it. I just wanna like share days in my life. So that's pretty much what my channel is gonna be. And I think it'll help just like Give me something to do and honestly keep me accountable, which sounds so awful, but I've been so bad at staying accountable with everything in my life. Um, I've basically been a little ball in a little apartment, a little Ohio, and just this little girl in this little shell. So I just want to celebrate my life again. I want to feel joy again. I'm going to cry, but I truly do. I feel like... We've just been going through so much shite over here. Um, so much crap that I want to share with you guys. So, I don't want to get emotional this early in the morning, but I'm going to bring you guys along for a couple days in my life over the weekend. And I think it'll be really good for me and hopefully you enjoy coming along too. So, this morning, we don't really have anything planned today, which kind of drives me crazy because I kind of like having plans and staying busy because when I do that, I thrive. The only thing set in stone today is I'm going to a yoga session class. I don't know what to call it. I think it's like a session or a class um, with a friend slash client of mine that's a nine and we're gonna get coffee and a little treat so i'm already kind of freaking out about food which kind of sucks but i'm not feeling hungry right now i think this will be a good little like check-in but i'm not feeling hungry right now so i think i'm gonna be okay but yeah we're going to a little yoga luga and i've never done a yoga session so we're gonna see how it goes I'm also wearing no pants right now, so you guys cannot see down there. But that's literally the only plan I have today. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to, like, go for a little bit of a walk. Just to, like, get some fresh air. And, yeah. Let's freaking go. Let's rumble. I hope you guys are happy to be here as much as I'm happy to be here. I already can't wait to just, like, share this video. You know. Right, sure. So let's get this day started. I think I want to water my plants first because they're dying. You guys will learn so quickly that our apartment is nothing special. Truly, the life we live is normal. I also need to clean our bathroom. I'm so bad at cleaning. I wish I liked cleaning. Don't overflow.
haven't posted in so long, so I'm sure you're wondering like what you're gonna expect from these videos. Literally my normal life. A normal girl in a normal world, just living her life. And I'm sure you're gonna come along with me and a lot of the things I might go through, you might be going through too, fitness-wise, food-wise, life-wise. I'm already stressing this morning, stressing about like getting the right content for this video, and I'm like, I just need to breathe. I need to breathe. Because if I don't get, like I'm worried about not getting clips in the yoga session, it's like, and? So what? I am getting a little bit hungry and I think I'm gonna make a small breakfast um just some eggs and like a yogurt little bowl and then probably get going I actually might make a cup of coffee because we're gonna get lattes but I kind of want just like one cup you know also this is my favorite we get this every time from Trader Joe's it's our favorite freaking blend from Trader Joe's now would I prefer a local coffee shop blend? Yes, but this works and we chop a Trader Joe's anyways, but it's so good. It's dark and it has sweet caramel flavor. So definitely try it out. So I'm gonna get some breakfast in me and then head out. I did it, no shells. I didn't want to like, I don't know, I have hunger, so I'm going to eat because I won't be eating for the next hour at least, well, hour and a half, so I want to be sure I sat down and ate, so I'm going to eat this breakfast and then I'm going to head out the door because I probably should get going here soon, so here's to some yummy eggs. Whenever I think I'm going to be on time, I'm not, and I always am running out the door. I almost even forgot my yoga mat. And that wouldn't have been good, but I have it. We're all here. I'm gonna probably not take too many clips in here because I just wanna be present and I just want to not worry about like getting content and if I get some, great. If I don't, whatever. Um, but I just really wanna work on being present, especially this weekend. So that's what I'm gonna do and I'm excited because I've never actually done a yoga session before. Um, and then afterwards I decided I am gonna go stop at a park and just like lay out a blanket and read a little bit of a book that I haven't picked up in probably a month and maybe get some content in this outfit. So that's kind of the tea. I'm on my way to yoga and yeah, I'll update you guys when I can. So yoga is done. 
that was a really good session i need to do yoga more often i just feel so much more just grounded but i just parked at a park parked at a park um and i'm gonna go find a spot to just like lay in the grass read some of this book and get some content in this little outfit so just taking this day for me taking it slow it just felt so good not to just stress about all the things and just really ground myself today Gonna be the spot. I think I just want to sit here, soak up the sun for a second. Maybe I'll move to the shade eventually, but I'm gonna get some content. And yeah, it's a, such a nice day, and there's so many beautiful spots. I need to do this more often. <laughs> took some content i'm really not sure how it turned out because my phone overheats so bad like and so quick and it's so annoying I took some content and now i'm actually gonna read a chapter even if i just read a chapter that's all i want to do i just want to sit here and enjoy the nature it is so nice like all of this behind me like i just want to stay out here all day <laughs> blast and AC but that was just so nice I did content I read a chapter I just sat there and it's making me see how much I need to slow down um, I think my body causing it so much stimulation first thing in the morning and just feeling so overwhelmed and stressed has been very hard on me and my mental health I've just noticed that I've become more anxious um, when I'm not taking things slow um, and when I hit the ground running like I go to the gym at, you know I wake up at 6 15 and then I try to shut out all my thoughts but they still come try to trickle in and I'm so stimulated it just has become hard for me to show up in that way and hard to show up in that type of routine honestly this entire day has been so needed this entire morning and I've just been such a worry wart with time and stress and routine and movement and trying to fit myself into this box when it's not a perfect box to begin with I've just it's exhausting I'm just in a phase in my life where slow and steady is going to run win the race for me quite honestly it's going to help me just be a better version of me each day I don't think I am in a phase where I can be go 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 anymore and I can't be so hyper focused on getting things done I need to give my brain and body some space to breathe because I feel like a 
stress ball. I feel like a stress ball right now. And I just need to breathe and show up slowly each day. So, I don't know what that's going to look like and I don't know what it's going to mean. But like, so far this vlog is exactly what I need. This is exactly what I need. I am ready to head home. That was such a nice little session. I still have some of my little Pop-Tart left. <laughs> but it has been so good for my mood and my brain and my energy to start my day exactly like this. Slow, steady, grounding myself. Let's head home and see what we get into. All right, lunch. I know I need food, so lunch is going down. I'm making a turkey sandwich on an English muffin. It's in the toaster. But I'm going to put this turkey breast on it, tomato, some spinach, and then, wow, this vegan creamy dill dressing. This is the best stuff ever. And then I just have honey mustard pretzels and some grapes. Where's my dad? All alone. looking kind of gloomy out. Well, I don't know where that's coming from, but I just mixed up. Where did that go? Where did that bag go? Oh, there it is. Wow, I'm a mess. Okay. I just mixed up electrolytes, just ingredients, Code Danielle. Um, so we've got a cutie little drink right here. I love electrolytes, especially when you're more active. I think I'm going to go on a run later. So, you know, I'm going to go on a run later because I kind of want to. And I'm excited, actually. So I'm going to have these electrolytes because I know I'll be sweaty afterwards. But I'm finding myself in a little scrolling moment. So I'm going to sit down and drink my little drink and get a little bit of work done. Yeah, I'm gonna finish my little Pop-Tart too. So we got Pop-Tart, electrolytes, and some work. Okay, a little update. Did like a little chunk of work. I feel like I'm better at baby steps, but I'm feeling a run. So I'm gonna go for a run. And I don't know how long, but I will update you guys after. Clay left me his Apple Watch. I haven't worn an Apple Watch in a while um, because it just becomes obsessive to me, especially the calorie part. Um, but I really love being able to track how long I'm running. So we're going to go get after it. And I like, kind of want to run three miles. I don't know why, but three miles has been my sweet spot lately. So... Woo! Okay, and it's a nice day. It's really pretty, and I'm just excited to go move my body in a way that I have been loving lately. So let's get this run. I'll update you guys after. Hi, vlog. Oh my gosh. I'm taking you off the tripod. Um, I totally forgot to update you when I got home, but... I went on a three mile run. It felt freaking fantabulous. It was a 10 out of 10 run, you guys. It felt so, it just felt so good. Running for some reason is my vibe. And now, let me show you what I'm doing. Dress from what is going down here. Can you, can you guess? Making brown butter. Brown butter chocolate chip cookies because I've been making a batch every week to have on hand and we bake them fresh with milk. It's the best dessert. It's the best. So I'm making a batch of that now and then make something for dinner. I'm thinking burgers. Burger because there's only one me here tonight. But yeah, 
I'm having fun browning this butter, it just takes forever. I'm such a messy bit. I just don't have patience. I just smush and go. We're multitasking. I'm simultaneously doing my cookie stuff while making dinner and we changed up dinner. I'll show you guys once it's done, but it's not burgers. I told you guys, not burgers. I'm craving spaghetti, so we're having it. I have bow tie pasta, and then I have some meat sauce and mozzarella. It looks so simple, but I'm so happy right now. Good morning, you guys. Out here on a walk. It's like 7.30. I woke up, and I... This is the best way to wake up, in my opinion. I am already in such a just better mindset than earlier this week. Just giving myself the time to rest and take mornings a little bit slower. So like this morning walk, I can just like soak up this freaking sun and just like be out here. It just feels so good. Mm -mm -mm. I'm soaking it the heck up. <sighs> this makes me want to go home and journal and gratitude. Oh my gosh. But anyways, welcome to another day in my life. Gonna pick up the camera, show you little moments, and go home, get ready. Because I'm meeting my sisters at a coffee shop. <sighs> you guys know I'm about to cry. The person I just passed had two collies. Oh my gosh, this is so hard for me to talk about. One second. Uh, the person for background, we had a collie growing up and he passed away like two years ago. And I just passed a lady with two collies. <laughs> and she was like training them to be quiet and not bark. She kept saying, quiet, stay by me. And she like said hi to me and I'm like, and I stayed quiet. I don't know why, that just made me so emotional. Every time I see Kali, I'm like, oh. anyway. So, plan for today, back to the plan for today. I'm gonna finish up this walk and I'm gonna go home, get ready. If I have time to like journal or like 
show myself some gratitude, write some things down, I might. Um, and then I'm gonna head out. I'm meeting my sisters at a coffee shop. I'm not sure which one yet because we like to go back and forth and get our way <laughs> on which one we're going to. But like, I know the good coffee shops, okay? Definitely need to go to Trader Joe's, get some groceries today. It's a laundry day. Um, and yeah, just getting ready for the week ahead. I really want to plan. <laughs> Uh, I really need to plant my, like, um, just, like, lifts because I think I'm going to switch my routine up with the gym. And I think I want it to be just be three full body because I'm in my running girl era and I've really been loving running. So I think I want to do three lifting sessions but then, like, muscle group split focused, if that makes sense. So just a day of catch up, a day of fun. So come along you guys i'm dying at the end of my walk i was just walking like on my normal path and this little kid comes out of the door of his house and he says hi and i say hi and he says what are you doing and i say walking as i just like continue to walk away and he said and then he kind of like sits there doesn't say anything for a second and then he says but why and i'm like because it feels good. And then he, like, I keep walking. And then he eventually says, because you like to exercise. It was just so cute. Like, kids are, like, they have no um, filter. And they'll just, like, ask any questions. And I kind of love it. It's, like, they're so curious. Um, but, yeah, that I just thought that was a funny way to end my workout and it reminded me I'm like yeah I'm walking because this feels good and I like exercise not because I want like to change my body or anything like that so anyways I just thought that was silly and I wanted to share so <sighs> I just had to like run and get ready because I didn't realize how close my sisters were so I'm on the way to the coffee shop that we're going to and I literally got ready in like five minutes so I literally had to stop journaling run myself around the town get myself mascara on and just I put my hair back in a clip so that wasn't the plan I was gonna actually like get ready but <laughs> that's fine breakfast with my sisters and now going to farmer's market to pick up some eggs because I'm close by so I figured why the heck not. Stop at the farmer's market because we love farm fresh eggs. They just are so much better. So I picked up two dozen because we go through them so dang quick um because i also love to bake and we eat eggs every morning so picked those up now i'm gonna head to trader joe's and i'll be sure to give you guys a little grocery haul but it is such a beautiful day out and yeah just feeling thankful blessed and ready to have a good rest of the day let's go through trader joe's haul these are pretty much weekly staples. Well, some of them aren't, but most of them are. So let's just start bag by bag. We've got bread. This is my favorite bread. Just toast, sandwiches. I use bread for everything. We've got tomatoes. We'll probably use these mostly for pizzas. <laughs> these are the best. Peanut butter cups. Dark chocolate peanut butter cups from Trader Joe's. I want to put these in my chocolate chip cookies that I make on the weekly. It's just mango slices. The only ingredient is dried mango. More brown sugar for baking because I've been a baking girl. Smoked paprika, one of my favorite seasonings from Trader Joe's. Teeny tiny avocados, Greek yogurt. I usually grab two tubs of this, but we just got one this week. I use Greek yogurt like I'm literally made of it. Um, Clay likes to drink sparkling water, so I got him one of those. Alfredo sauce. This is also for Clay because he uses this for his pizza. And then I use this tomato basil red sauce. Baby broccolini. 
carrots for snacking. Maple chicken sausage, and then this jalapeno chicken sausage. Pre-cooked chicken. Tortillas for clay. This pesto is the best pesto. I want to put this on our pizzas, put it on sandwiches. We've got some turkey breasts. This is also for clay. And some prosciutto. I want to put this on our pizzas. <laughs> We've been obsessed with pizzas lately, okay? We've got 96 for ground beef along with 99.1 ground turkey. I've been trying to incorporate more red meat because I feel like I need more iron. And with this ground turkey, I usually ground it up with taco seasoning and use it for lunches. We've got some chicken breast. And then if you don't get this rice, you need to. It's the best. This is like the only rice we eat. It's just pop it in the freaking microwave for three minutes and you're good to go. We've got arugula, chives. Peaches are in season right now. We've been loving peaches. We've been peaches crazy. We've been eating like crazy. A tomato. I usually buy a bag or two of this jerky just because it's a good snack. Best barbecue sauce. We use this like crazy along with the best freaking ranch. Another one of these because I can never have too many on hand. The 72% dark chocolate chips. I use those for our cookies. Grapes. We've been loving grapes. And then a watermelon because I decided I wanted a watermelon. I just have to cut it up now. And then of course we have our eggs. So that was all... $150 and this is usually like weekly staples if not we get like a few extra things or other things um, but that's a little Trader Joe's haul now I'm gonna put this all away and then I think I'm gonna spend a little bit of time cleaning before Clay's get, Clay gets home so <laughs> I just spent some hours doing some things. Um, laundry is started. I still have lots of laundry to do. I'm waiting for Clay to get home. He should be at home any minute. I just ate a bowl of watermelon and cleaned the bathrooms, changed the sheets, just tidied up a little bit and it feels really good. I'm gonna try and figure out what I want my three lifting sessions to look like. Again, I kind of want full body. Three full body sessions. That's kind of an update. I'm gonna be on my computer work for a little bit and then see what Clay wants to do tonight. TikTok sound is in my head. Where's my dad? I'm all alone. I feel that several times in my life. I'm not gonna lie. 
especially when it comes to my car or our apartment and something's wrong. When there's like a problem that is a handy issue. Where's my dad? I'm all alone. Where's Fred at nowadays? I need to know. Fred. Where's <laughs> Fred? Did you ever watch Fred? His name isn't even Fred. I'm going to Instagram to see what he's up to. Oh my gosh, he has an Instagram. Fred? F R E D. Fred? Is that what you said earlier? Yeah. Oh, yes. Remember him? Happy lungs. No, that's a different guy. Now I get it. I don't know. I know who you're talking about, but I forget. I don't know. Butter bread is hidden. Butter bread. Babe, do you want milk? 